Oh my god! Look at that building! Holy crap, dudes! Good morning, everyone. I am at Balanced Rock Campground in or near Twin Falls, Idaho. It's really cool. I think everybody should check it out. It's seven days um, limit stay free. It's got a pit toilet and um, picnic tables and some stuff I'll show you. It's got some trash cans. I'm looking at one right now. So it's a taken care of free campground next to the Balanced Rock which I think is on the other side of the road. So we're gonna go for a little walk and check it out. It looks like there's a walking section or where it splits. So pretty around here. It looks like there's water in this tunnel. Oh. My mom called this plant um, doe ears because it feels fuzzy. All right, one plant distraction already. All these tumbleweeds. <laughs> okay, going in the creepy tunnel. Uh, those are like really big to like walk on and I don't want to get wet. I, I don't think this is a walking tunnel. I don't think so. Looks like I definitely get wet with gross water. And there's tumbleweeds all the way down it. So. Alright. I need to eat breakfast though, so. Let's go do that. So I'm going to try this uh, Double Joy Select Premium Coffee. It's just this little packet I dumped in here and then I'll put the hot water in it. I'm excited to try it. I've got some hazelnut creamers up here that I can put with it to make it taste good, good, good. And then I was also finishing up, I added some more water to last night's lemon ginger tea. And both uh, the tea and this coffee was given to me by subscribers, so thank you guys so much. And this is, I love the little things. Say it straight, simple, and with a smile. Oh, and there goes the last of my neighbors, driving out. Alright, I'm headed off into town. I'm leaving the campground and gonna go... I think I might go to the library, but I definitely want to get into service because I have no service down here and check up on social media and where I want to go to next. Um, but definitely before I go, I just remembered, I gotta go across to the other side of this highway and check out the actual balanced rock. So, here we go. So it says balanced rock, 48 feet high, 40 feet wide, I can't read the rest, but it is over here. 
Look at that. There is the balanced rock that the campground that I was at is for. It's super cool. It looks like there is a trail going up to it. Um, I probably won't take the trail. Here it is. Well, and look at the whole little range of uh, hoodoos or rock formations. Now I'm gonna go head back into town and check out what else is out there. I'm thinking about going to a place called City of Rocks, so I'll probably be seeing a lot of big rocks today. training holy crap that sign just said fire training oh look at this fire training everyone oh my gosh that is so scary look at all the people ah oh my god look at that building holy crap dudes this is insane been watching it and I was like I can see the flames oh my god Whew. I'm glad that said fire training but why did they have to do it right on the side of the road oh my god it's like out of freaking control look at that oh my god that is scary Whew. don't see that every day I made it to the library and I'm feeling a little jazzed after seeing that fire like right next to the road. So I'm gonna try and go work for an hour or two, get some stuff together, and then get back out on the road and head to the next town. Um, if I end up staying here a little bit too long because sometimes I just get sucked into the library, I'll probably go back to, out to that campground and stay another night. But I am wanting to get to the next town and I probably will still be in Idaho um, tonight and into tomorrow. Um, like I said, I wanted to go check out the City of Rocks, which is south of here. It's a big rock climbing area, and my mom suggested I go. So, there's that. I am having a hard-boiled egg, the last one that I have. Spent four hours at the library, and it was uber fun. I'm going to head over to the town of Alamo, which is where the City of Rocks is, or Castle Rock um, State Park, Idaho State Park. So I think it's like $5 to get in, and there are some free campsites near it. I've got my noodles right there, and I've got maps all set up, so I'm about to drive to my campsite. I'm in the little town of Albion, I think is how you say it, Albion. And I have passed by a pumpkin patch and a haunted house. So even though I'm kind of out in small town Idaho, they still take Halloween very seriously. A lot of creepy buildings too. I looked at the haunted house buildings, they're pretty intense. Driving through the little town of Alamo right now, so I'm really close to where my campsite is tonight. I just have to go out of town a little bit on the south side. The visitor center, City of Rocks, Castle Rocks. So, oh, that's right over there, so I can check that out tomorrow. Ooh, pavement ends. Oh, this is interesting. highway just turned into a dirt road. So I'm at Castle RV Park and it is $10 to stay here even though it looks like nobody stayed here in eons. I can see little spots for um, where they've got stoves, above ground stoves. So 
I looked at the map again and it shows that I'm really close to where I want to camp, which is just like basically open land. I'm in open land. I just need to go on designated BLM or National Forest, forest land. So that's where I'm headed to right now. This sign right here says U.S. Department of Interior Bureau of Land Management. So I see one van up here already. I'm doing pretty good. It's right past um, what looks like a little RV park, but it's private land. So I think they must have like, they just set up hookups for them, for their campers on their land. Um, it's pretty cool. So this is a hairy road. Um, definitely, definitely some odd spots to be driving. Hopefully there is some room up here where this van is and I'm not completely encroaching and being rude. Ooh, interesting. Do not want to pop a tire out here. Okay. Well, there I just hit one. This road is extremely bumpy. I don't remember reading that in the reviews. Okay. I'm having a mini meltdown right now. Um, no cutting trees. Be nice to the next visitor. How about have a decent road? Oh, my butt hurts. Okay, that was a bumpy road. It's pretty, it's really pretty. I wanted to go camp over there. There's another spot, but there's a tent there. And there's like some bushes in between me and that site, so I'm feeling good. And the other guy is way down there, um, right in between there. I've got a campfire. I'm not gonna make a campfire though. And okay, I'm on a huge slope though, going down hill so hopefully I don't roll out of bed thank you guys so much for watching this vlog I hope you enjoyed it I'm gonna go get all tucked in and ready for the night and the sun is obviously gone so this is my last little bit of sunlight I'll check in with you guys in the morning and have a great day stay curious